guy prepared overnight 1,000 slices of bread. Then he took out his laxative and sprinkled it evenly on the slices of bread. Then he went to the square where pigeons are forbidden to be fed. He ripped open the plastic bag. He poured the 1,000 slices of bread into the middle of the square. He wanted to test what would happen to the pigeons if they ate the laxative. But before the pigeons could eat it, the sanitation workers in the square shoveled all the slices of bread into the rubbish bin with a grumble. But the man wasn't going to give up, so he ran into the supermarket. He emptied his pockets. He bought 600 bags of bread and two boxes of powerful laxatives to prevent the sanitation workers from removing them as rubbish again. This time he chose a place where there were no sanitation workers. He carried the slices of bread to the square and then scattered the bread all over the ground. Soon the smell of the bread attracted the pigeons in the area. As the pigeons grew in number, the boy was overjoyed. He was wiggling his butt and waiting for the pigeons to poop. The square is filled with pigeons, all grabbing the slices of bread on the ground. It was a spectacular scene. Visitors pull out their mobile phones, stopping to watch, not even realizing they're about to have a strange baptism. As the slices of bread are eaten up, the flock of pigeons are all flying high on their wings. Yet the next moment,